Hi everybody and welcome to our fourth Woe You Pack. I hope you're all well. Um, it seems like we've been a long time without seeing each other, but another pack is coming out to you so you can all take part at home and share things that we've created in our group chats and in, on the Facebook page so we can still keep in touch that way. So this week we are welcoming back Ildi who delivered a couple of sessions for us previously. She delivered the fantastic willow basket making session and our needle felting session as well. So hi Ildi, how are you? Hello everybody, it's nice to be back. I'm looking forward to share this month's art pack with you that I I created for you. <laughs> so Ildi, can you tell us a little bit about yourself as an artist? Um, what, what you do, what's your practice? Yeah, so my name is Ildi Kornaj and uh, I'm Hungarian. I've been living in the UK for 10 years, but I always been making something. And my practice is including arts and crafts. And um, recently, I my favorite thing has become the basket weaving. Before that, I have been making loads of things out of felt. So it's the wool. And uh, and uh, before that, I have been doing loads of illustrations and paintings and sewing projects in my life. So. Um, I would call myself as an interdisciplinary artist, never stopping, always creating a creature. <laughs> Brilliant. So with that in mind, I'm quite excited to find out what we are going to be making this time and what's in our pack. And for this time, for this month, I created um, a pointillistic Mona Lisa project for you. And that's uh, going to be based mainly on felt making. That's great, Ildi. Um, so with this type of felt making, does it have a history to it? Is it a heritage craft at all? Yes, it is. Uh, felt making is a heritage craft. And uh, what we are going to do this time is not going to be needle felting, but it's going to be wet felting. So this is um, a lot easier. Uh, technique than needle felting then we're definitely not going to poke ourselves mm -hmm. this time and um, there's a nice story um, about felt making how it's actually been discovered um, I think it was San Clements um, who who has been on a long journey and uh, his soul his soul feet um, were so painful from the lot of walking that he stuffed some uh, sheep wool into his sandals and then uh, and then later on he realized after a couple of days walks and sweat and all that pressure all that wool he tucked in turned into one piece of sock so that was the main discovery of how to create uh, sorry that was my dog <laughs> how to create a, a piece of a piece of material textile it is by applying pressure on it and the sweat so a bit of moisture and then you can you can turn any sort of wool into felt you can see the image on the screen uh, what we're making and um, you will see everything in the demo uh, very shortly
Childy for showing us the process of how to make the um, pointillist Mona Lisa. It's amazing. Just want to say to everybody, I hope you're all well and take care. And please do share all of your fantastic creations as normal on the WhatsApp group chat and our Facebook Where You page so that we can all have a look at what each other has made. So thanks again, Ildi. It's been fabulous having you back with us for this fourth Where You Pack. Yes, thank you very much. And uh, I hope you ladies uh, will all enjoy crafting this month. 